So what exactly is the difference between a project manager and a scrum master? And I typically get this question from those that work in the IT industry. Because essentially Agile is pretty popular in the IT industry, but not so much in other industries. So in this video, let's try to understand what is the difference between these two terms, a project manager and a scrum master. So let me share my screen. So who exactly is a project manager? To begin with, this post, the project manager post is industry agnostic. That means you will find project managers in IT, software, construction, healthcare, finance, engineering, manufacturing. You will find the post of the project manager in all these different industries. But at the same time, Scrum Master is someone that is limited to mostly IT and software industry because Scrum is essentially a way of working in Agile. So Agile is an umbrella term. It has several ways that you can deliver projects. Scrum is one of the ways under that umbrella using which you can essentially deliver IT and software projects. But we are also seeing that Scrum Master position is something that is getting popular, gaining ground in marketing, education, and healthcare sectors as well. Now, project manager within the IT industry, it is more concentrated in the services domain, working on projects to deliver software and IT services. So typically in the IT and software industry, you will find that there are service-based companies and then there are product-based companies. Service-based companies essentially provide software and IT services to other customers. Their customers are also businesses in most of the cases. Product-based companies essentially have a software product that they sell to their customers. And their customers are also in most cases businesses. So essentially in the services domain, in the service-based companies, you will find project manager position is essentially existing and flourishing. But when it comes to Scrum Master, this is present in both services as well as product-based companies. But Scrum overall favors the product way of working because it talks about continuous delivery. If you have read anything about Scrum and if you have not, then I would highly suggest you to check out the second link in the description and entire playlist of all the videos that we have done in the area of Scrum. If you want to know more about Scrum, that is. So someone that's working in the Scrum environment is essentially doing continuous delivery. In every sprint, they are delivering something rather than services which has fixed scope delivery. So in the services sector, right, in service-based software companies, there is essentially a fixed scope that the team works on, that the project team works on. So the scope is fixed and that is how a customer is built. But in product-based companies, you will find that they do continuous delivery. It is possible that even in services, uh, you will find continuous delivery, but definitely something to be aware of. As a project manager, customer interaction Triple constraints management, triple constraints basically means your cost, scope and schedule, direct and monitor control the work, right? So this is something that a project manager is supposed to do. He's supposed to interact with the customer. He's supposed to manage the triple constraints. He's supposed to direct the project team and he's supposed to monitor and control the work. But as a scrum master, what you're supposed to do is coach, mentor, facilitate and remove any impediments that the scrum team faces. A project manager essentially gets things done, but a scrum master ensures that the scrum principles are followed and the team is self-organizing. So the big difference here is that as a project manager, you are directing the team, you are monitoring and controlling the work that they do. But as a scrum master, you need to ensure that the team understands what the scrum principles are. They understand what the values are. And then 
they organize themselves because it's a self-organizing team. A scrum team is a self-organizing team, right? So they organize themselves and they work on their own. Finally, PMP, CAPM, PRINCE2, these are some of the most popular certifications for project managers. At the same time, PMI, ACP, CSM, Scale Agile, all of these are very popular certifications for Scrum Master position. In one of my other videos, I've done a wide comparison of all the certifications that are available out there. That will also be linked in the description. Check out the third link in the description if you want to check that video out. All right, so that's all that I had in this video. I hope you enjoyed it and found the information helpful. Like, share, subscribe. If you like our work, consider contributing by using the thanks button on YouTube or heading over to pmclounge.com slash contribute. Also, don't forget to check out our website, pmclounge.com, your number one free PMP and project management resource. Thank you and have a nice day.